Hi guys, it's Carol. <laughs> I wanted to tell you thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for all the good wishes and prayers and good vibes you sent this way. My ex-husband is doing better. Well, he's still with us anyway. Um, he's on the ventilator and will be for a minimum of three weeks. Um, my kids are horribly upset, of course, uh, but I, I'm upset too. Um, he's been in my life since I was 15 and I'm 67. He's 67 too. Uh, you know, and we had four kids together and we were married for 19 years. So, um, we didn't have a hateful divorce or anything. So, you know, I care about him too. I wouldn't wish COVID on anybody. Um, I'm grateful for his wife because, uh, he's a real stubborn person. <laughs> uh, Sunday, um, for, well, let me back up. He had the week before he had two negative COVID tests. And then he got bad and she took him to the ER and there he had a positive COVID test, but they sent him home. And I think that was on Friday. And then on Sunday, he just, Sunday night, he was really, really bad, could not breathe. And so she told him they had to go to the ER and he didn't want to go. He just fought her. No, he wasn't going to go to the ER. He wasn't. Finally, she won and got him to the ER. When they got there, you know, you have to wait and wait and wait. He did not want to wait. He wanted to leave, but she managed to keep him there. Um, if they had gone home from the ER without seeing a doctor, he would have passed that night at home. Um, because by 10 the next morning, he could just gasp for air. And they were doing the ventilator. So, um, hopefully this, hopefully he'll make it. But it is scary. It is scary. Uh, he had not had the vaccine. Uh, his wife hadn't had the vaccine. Uh <laughs> My two daughters and my son that lives here have not had the vaccine. I have. And, you know, everybody has their own choice. Toby. But I wish my kids would get it. Uh, my old, my son in Seattle did. I wish the kids here would get it. But we'll see. I think this terrified them enough that they would think, even if they got it, it might be better. I mean, it might not be so hard. Um, but anyway... And then my grandson, who has COVID, his girlfriend's stepdad has COVID. And <laughs> later. Oh, sorry. I'm going to add the rest of my video here. But anyway, thank you. Hello, guys. I just got a new vacuum. I ordered it from Walmart. It is, um, I chose it by price. It was $59.99. It said roll back from $129.99, so $60 works for me. I don't have a very big apartment, and I'm not really dirty. You know, I don't track mud and dirt in or anything. So this will work fine for me. Um, I don't know what max swivel means, but okay. I will show you how it works. Okay, guys, this is what it picked up. Uh, from my living room. That's mostly dog hair from my daughter's beagle <laughs> and some carpet fiber. Um, I had vacuumed yesterday with my old vacuum. So, you know, obviously it picked up some more stuff. My old vacuum cleaner just was on its last leg. But anyway, the only thing that was weird about it is it moves, um, the handle moves like that. And I've always had a vacuum with a real rigid handle but I after I vacuumed and it felt like that I looked it up and that's what the max swivel thing is uh, let me get the box it's supposed to swivel like that if you're vacuuming around something I guess but anyway I love it, it works for me and $59.99 was in my budget so there we go this is not a sponsored video Hi. <laughs> it's cuddle time for me and the dogs. <laughs> I wanted to show you my new glasses. 
uh, these are the ones I ordered from Zenny Optical, not a sponsored video. I let my granddaughter pick out my frames because there were like 1,500 frames. And then I narrowed it down to like a dozen that I liked. And then it just got so overwhelmed, I didn't want to pick. So I told my 10-year-old granddaughter, you pick. <laughs> and she did. And actually, I like them. They, they're they blue. They don't look like it here, but they're blue. It's kind of a, a purplish blue. And then it fades as they go down. They're awfully big, but all the frames... Uh, Big is popular now, <laughs> evidently. They were all pretty big. And I can see great. Um, they cost me $94 and some change, which is like <laughs> $400 less or more than they would have been at Walmart. I will show you the quote I was given from the optometrist where I went and then I'll see if I can pull up what I paid for these and show you the, what the different you know the thin lens cost and all that stuff but I like them I can see great and I love cine optical <laughs> I really am pleased with them I, you know from the second I put them on I didn't have any adjustment problems or anything so woohoo and if you ever want to buy glasses, let me know if you want to order from Zenny. If, you, if, we, if we do something, you'll get $5 and I'll get $5. So if you are interested in ordering glasses from Zenny, let me know. All right. I'm going to pull up the... Yes, I love you too. <laughs> I'm going to pull up my record so you can see what everything costs. Just a second. This is uh, the quote from the optometrist office. The no line bifocals would be 350, transition lens 120, anti reflectant coating 155, and then thin lens $100 to make uh, add up to 725. That did not include frames. And this was the place where the frames were exorbitant. They were like, I picked up one pair that was $800 just for the frame. <laughs> so I did not shop there. <laughs> okay, here is my order from Zenny. You can see my frames cost $15.95. On lens, that gives me the thin lens, the blocks, and the progressive um, bifocal, no line bifocal for $93.95 for the, all of that. Anti-reflection coating was included, makes my whole price $109.90. But then they had a coupon where you could get $20 off if your order was over $100. So that brought my uh, order down to $94.85, including $4.95. did goof up sort of when I ordered them I ordered the blocks which um, blocks the blue light from screens as well as UV rays and it protects you from UV rays inside or out I didn't get the kind of lens that go dark outside if I'd wanted that it would have only been six dollars more and it was called blocks chromatic 